Now, let's answer questions from one of our followers. Pini-PM niya ito sa FB page na ito. So, we have ilan ba ito? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Itong lima ang sagutan natin sa video ito. And by the way, kung mayroon kayong mga tanong sakaling nagawa na natin yan ng mga tutorial videos, ganito lang yung pag-search nyo. Bali, isulat lahat yan siyang tanong na yan, tapos idugtong yung lunalin para mas madaling ma-sort out, baka meron na tayong ganyan na mga videos. Ganon ang pag-search. Pag Kasi ang dami na natin nagawang video, siguro mga 2,000 mahigit na ng mga video sa ating YouTube channel. So anyway, itong limang questions na ito ay hindi lang to gamit para sa mga magtitake ng civil service exam. Pati na rin sa magtitake ng AFSAT, sa LET, sa college entrance test or kung anong exam man yan na merong numerical reasoning or yung mga mathematics. So anyway, since madali lang naman ang mga questions na ito, so, sa isang video lang natin to gagawin, sa isang video ito. When it comes to mathematics, relax lang. Math lang yan. Madali lang yung mathematics. Kasi kung pangunahan nyo ng takot ang mathematics, mahihirapan kayong mag-solve. Imbis na madali lang sana yung tanong, ino-overthink mo pa so lalong mahihirapan kayo. Now, let's do number one. Dave is 46 years old. Twice as old as Rajiv. Ayawang ko kung paano yan i-pronounce. Ang tanong, how old is Rajiv? Kapag sinabing twice as old as Rajiv, bali, mas older si Dave. Now, sa choices naman, puro naman yan less than 46. So, ibig sabihin, confirm na mas older nga si Dave kay ni Rajiv. Kapag sinabing twice as old as Rajiv, itong si 46, i-divide natin ng 2. Bakit hindi i-multiply ng 2? Kasi nga itong si Dave ay older than Rajiv. So anyway, twice as old as Rajiv, ang ibig sabihin niyan ay i-divide lang natin itong si 46 by 2, 46 divided by 2, and this is 23. Kaya ang edad ni Rajiv, kung paano yan i-pronounce, ay 23 years old. Next, number 2. Salesperson Rita drives 2,052 miles in 6 days, stopping 2 towns each day. How many miles does she average between stops? Now, Kada araw, may dalawang town siyang ini-stop. So, twice siyang nag-stop sa kada araw. Ilang araw yan siya? Six days. So, sa six days, twice siyang mag-stop. So, therefore, merong 12 stops dito. Ang tanong, how many miles does she average between stops? So, therefore, itong 2,052 miles, i-divide natin sa 12. 12 stops. 20 divided by 12, this is 1. 1 times 12. So, i-minus natin yan. This is 8. Bring down natin si 5. 85, ilang 12 ba si 85? This is 7. Uh, 14 carry 1. This is 84. I-minus natin yan. Bring down natin si 12. So, 12 divided by 12 and that is 1. Ang sagot ay... 171 miles. Ganun lang siya kadali. Next, number three. During the last week of track training, Shuzana achieves the following times in seconds. So, ito yung mga seconds. Her three best times this week are average for her final score on the course. What is her final score? Piliin lang natin, dito sa given na mga seconds na yan, yung tatlong best. Tatlong best, ibig sabihin, yun yung pina track, kwan yan siya, track training. So, yung pinaka least. We have 54, dalawang 54, at si 57. 
Yan lang yung tatlo. Yun yung pinaka three best times. So, si 57, 54, 50, uh, dalawang 54. Kung ito yung highest na 54, kung i-average mo yan siya, for sure, ito yung solution number one. Nga, ganun lang kasi siya kadali na no need na mag-solve-solve. For sure, hindi yan siya 57. Kasi nga, 57 yung highest sa tatlong best na yan. For sure, hindi yan lalampas ng 61, lalo namang hindi itong 59. Dapat within dyan. So, isa lang naman na 55 seconds, yan na yung sagot. Now, solution number 2. I-average natin yan. Bali, i-add natin yan divided by 3. And this is 55. Kaya sagot dito ay 55 seconds. May isa pa. Ito, uh, gawin natin, i-minusan natin ng 2. So, this will be 55. Yang minus na 2 na yan, Dito natin i-add yung dalawa na yan. So, 55 seconds. So, ito na yung average. Next, number 4. A train must travel to a certain town in 6 days. The town is 3,450 miles away. How many miles must the train average each day to reach its destination? Six days yan siya nag-travel. Now, each day daw, ilan? So, ganu ganito lang siya kadali. I-divide lang natin itong 3,450 by 6. So, si 34, ilan yan siya? 5, 5 times 6, and this is 30. 34 minus 30. This is 4. Bring down natin si 5. Ilang 6 ba sa 45? We have 7. This is 42. Tama ba? And this is 3. Bring down natin yung 0. 30 divided by 6 and that is 5. Ang sagot dito ay 575 miles. Next, number 5. On a certain day, the nurses at the hospital work the following number of hours. So, meron tayong, huwag na natin ibasahin na lahat. Meron tayong 8. 10, 9, 8, 7, 12. What is the average number of hours work per nurse on this day? I-add natin yung mga numbers na yan. Tapos, i-divide kung ilan ba sila. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I-divide natin ng 6. So, anyway, i-write down ko yan siya. 9, 8, so, we have 7 and 12. 8 and 9, this is 17. So, 7, 8, this is 5. 5, 2, and this is 4. 1, 2, 3, 54. See, 54, i-divide natin. Ilan nga ba yung sinabi ko? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I-divide natin ng 6. So, this is 9. 9 times 6, this is 54. So anyway, ang sagot dito ay 9. Thank you for watching and all. I hope mayroon kayong natutunan sa video ito. Thank you and God bless.